With 30 satellite tags deployed in blue marlin, black marlin, and sailfish in six countries, the second year of the IGFA Great Marlin Race tracked a total of 17,059 nautical miles on imperiled billfish species. The IGFA's Billfish Research Project is a partnership with Stanford University, and in addition to tracking 5,000 more nautical miles than the previous year, the IGMR grew in 2013 by adding a postdoctoral position in Dr. Barbara Block's lab at Stanford. In the past few years, we've recorded more than 31,000 nautical miles worth of billfish movement data, and other important information such as open ocean habitat usage, diving profiles, where billfish spend most of their time in the water column, and the preferred water temperatures. We're making all of these data available to scientists around the world, and having access to this kind of data is what researchers really need in order to better understand how these incredible animals are using their environment. One winner is designated from each tournament event during which IGMR satellite tags are deployed during the race year. Last race year, tagging events took place in the Canary Islands, Spain, Madeira, Portugal, Hawaii, USA, Lizard Island, Australia, Salinas, Ecuador, San Juan, Puerto Rico, and Puerto San Jose, Guatemala. The overall winner is the tag that travels the farthest of all those deployed. This year's third place tag traveled 1,222 nautical miles and was sponsored by Michelle Marchandise during the 5th annual Madeira Blue Marlin Tournament in Portugal. The second place tag was sponsored by Star Electrical and traveled 1,743 nautical miles after being deployed during the 53rd annual Hawaiian International Billfish Tournament in Kona, USA. But the first place tag for the 2012-2013 IGMR race year traveled a whopping 2,577 nautical miles, 15% of the total miles tracked during the year. Our congratulations go out to Peter Teagle, who sponsored the winning tag during the 26th annual Lizard Island Black Marlin Classic in Australia. We're very appreciative to all the sponsors, tournaments, event organizers who are helping us deploy these satellite tags each year. We've already been able to utilize these data to better protect billfish stocks, and the next challenge will be how to reverse population declines. Collecting and making these data available to researchers and fisheries managers worldwide is an integral part of solving that problem. The IGFA congratulates Peter Teagle on winning the IGFA Great Marlin Race for the 2012-2013 race year.